Okay, dust control. Uh, so along with all those trucks that were traveling around the base, we have robust dust control measures in place. So a few steps in the process. Um, you see a laborer here installing some fabric, uh, privacy fabric, but it also works to uh, divert any sort of uh, dust coming off the job site. So that'll be installed on fencing. Uh, of course, we always went down excavations. You saw the picture earlier, the demolition. We pretty much always apply uh, water to any activity that's going to generate dust, so that will, that will continue. Um, one other activity is the height from which we dump the bucket into the trucks. So there's going to be a lot of loading of trucks, right? So 15 cubic yards go into a truck. So that's a lot of, you know, maybe three yards in a bucket. So there's a lot of, a lot of buckets. Uh, that height is limited and we have a restriction on that. Uh, so it doesn't produce dust. Of course, high wind conditions on the island are frequent, so we would uh, cease any sort of operations during high wind activity. Um, and soil stockpiles, I don't know if you folks have seen this out there, but this uh, green agent out here, we know it as Gorilla Snot. Uh, that's actually the trade name. Uh, it's a tackifier, so it will be placed on top of soil stockpiles that, are, that will stay for a while. Um, and that actually hardens, it's like, a, like an ice cream shell, and it hardens the outside and it'll keep the wind from blowing out any dust around. Trucks and dust control. So, of course, roadways will be, will be watered, um, as you see here in the top picture. We have rumble strips that will vibrate the tires of the trucks leaving the job site. So this is going to happen at any exit point where a truck maybe, um, maybe, I'll use the pointer, uh, maybe tracking through, say, some, some wet mud or an excavation or something like that where their tires may get gummed up. Uh, track out prevention is a big thing as well. Uh, so that's anything that may be tracked out onto a roadway, whether it's um, from import trucks or from our uh, transport trucks. Any, any dust or, or track out will be cleaned up immediately. Uh, we will implement wet sweeping and street cleaning as well during all soil activities. And another thing here is covered trucks. It says at all, all times, it's actually all times. So any truck carrying contaminated material, so along that red line that we pointed out before, always covered. That truck returning, empty, always covered. So if the truck had any sort of contaminated material in it, it will be uh, covered at all times. Uh, trucks coming on to site with clean back will also be covered as well. So that's an important uh, rule that we are doing. Next. 